about four or five years I've been observing this ant hill. And then a couple of days ago someone came along and they killed it. I complained about it. A couple of people walking down the sidewalk and said, well, if one of them crawl up your leg and bit you, you wouldn't be upset about it. Well, that's ridiculous. Standing around that ant hill for two hours one time and didn't get one sting. You know, ants are funny animals. Uh, I remember a place in Bolivia. Every morning, set your clock to it. At 9.30 every morning, a swarm of ants would come through the village. Those ants were, most of them were more than an inch long. They'd swarm through that village every day for about an hour and a half to two hours. Not one person would get stung by them. Hell, they'd let them in their houses. They'd clean the garbage. Pick up all the litter. <laughs> Not one person ever got stung in that village. They're uh, the shaman of that village. He would go over there to their uh, nest every day and leave an offering. And thank them. Thank them for helping to clean their village. You wouldn't find any grasshoppers or cockroaches or any of those uh, sleeping sickness bugs. You wouldn't find any of them in that village. Uh, the same ants are called army ants and if you fall in their nest and you're not invited, you probably get eaten alive. People that respect nature and live with it, they have a different attitude. We live in a modern age. All these people, they don't respect nature. No safe place, no safe space in nature. There's just life. Compare this scene to seen in the middle of Baltimore which was which is better <laughs>